Hey guys, you're watching Zimon and My name is AJ. Welcome back to another episode of City Skylines, episode uh, 38, I think. Yeah, 38. Uh, last episode, we finished off waiting 20 weeks uh, to unlock the posh mall. I've let it run. We're up to 18 weeks. It's been quite the balancing act, and I'm going to adjust this again. I'm going to drop this down a little bit lower, okay, because we had these set all the way down to save as much money as we could. And we were only losing about 50,000. The only trouble was is that we were losing like 100,000. Um, we've gone down to 100. In fact, at one point, I got down to, I think, about 88,000 people. It's now going back up again because I put these services way up again and just took the brunt of the loss of money. And now I'm slowly editing it down again, just keeping us in the positive population, like weekly change. Uh, but trying to keep our weekly income as sort of stable as possible. We are going to do it. We've got 1.4 million left. I mean, it, it has taken all of our money that's been needed. Uh, but we've only got the two weeks left. Close to be one week, hopefully, after that I've finished this sentence. Maybe this last day is going to tip it over to 19 weeks. Come on. Come on. What day? What year are we in? 2035. Wow. So we've been going for 20 years on this game. Because I think it starts in 2015. Doesn't take... Yeah, there's 19 weeks. One more week. We can count them down. Seven. <laughs> six. <laughs> Not quite six yet. We're doing okay, though. Our employment percentage is through the roof, okay? Back up to 93%. However, I've got a feeling that it's not going to stay like that. It's only this high because... Of we've got half the population less than half of what we should have in the city So I'm expecting that to actually drop down when our city recovers in population and everybody starts flooding back in again I think that's what I'm suggesting anyway our power water and sewage is through the roof for a few reasons one We actually lost quite a few buildings. They actually got become abandoned when they moved out obviously uh, but also uh, because we've dropped down the uh, budget for all of the services they're not using as much, which is okay. How are we? Have we done it yet? We must be so close. We like, must be like one or two days away now. I've been waiting for this for a really long time. We attempted this about ten episodes ago, and uh, we just didn't have the money to do it. We've only just had the money to do it this time, though. Like we're, we, we might dip just under a million. I don't think we will. I think we'll stay above a million. But we're going to do it. We're going to get that Hadron Collider, which it says is going to sort out education for the entirety of our city which should hopefully really help out on trying to get 50% of our population well educated because if that sorts it all out we don't have to worry about spamming um, schools about everywhere do we ah there it is posh mall okay sort this out they can go back up again and oh that one stays down though and the taxes go up again get up there I'll adjust them a little bit more in a second. I just need to get... <laughs> I need to save my city first. I'm pretty sure they're all on 12%. I think that's what we agreed on in the end. Whew. Okay, so that will even itself out. That little balance will start getting uh, people flooding in. I've got a feeling this Hadron Collider... <gasps> I'll construct the posh mall. I say, I thought that's all I need to do. How much is that? 800,000. Okay, that isn't actually so bad. The posh mall is only 45,000. I'm going to put that down. The fanciest of fancy malls for all the fancy people. Requirement for building the Hadron Collider. A fancy mall. Do we put it in the middle? Oh, no. What does this do? It does good things. Oh, it's going to be commercial, isn't it, for the people? I reckon we should put that up here. This this place has, like, nothing good. So maybe right at... Wait a minute. What is... Yeah, that is residential. So it's a good place to go there. Yeah, see all these gaps, look, where all the people moved out. They'll all, they'll all fill in. That ain't going to be too much of a problem. Okay, will this fit in one of these gaps, or am I going to have to delete a road? I'm going to have to delete a little road. I'm going to delete that one right there. I'm going to put that right there. Boom. Oh, check that out. Oh, froze. Everybody got so happy it made me freeze. Look at that. So what does this say here, then? Just visit as a very posh mall. It's not bad. It's got like a really cool wood texture. It's got a bit of frame rate associated with it. But that is really cool. I like that building. We're unlocking all of the special ones. So we should have now the Hadron Collider. I love 
this in real life. The Hadron Collider in real life is amazing. So in here, it's going to be crazy. Noise pollution. It has to go in the middle here, doesn't it? It just has to. 800,000? Ah, screw it. We're getting so much money in. Look at that. The Hadron Collider. I thought that was spinning then for a second. The Hadron Collider takes care of your education needs with the Had Hadron Collider. So it sorts out the whole thing, it should. Yeah, elementary school through the roof. High school through the roof. Capacity of one million. No joke. So we can literally remove all of the other schools in our city. That'll help on money and space. All right, sweet. Let's do that. Yep. 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 And no point having them here. That sorts it all out. That's what it's there for. That's what these end game buildings do. They, oops, sorry, skyscraper. They help out the the building in gen, uh, the whole city, uh, just with one building. That's crazy. All right, because we we spam these about everywhere because you just had, you just needed to. It's a very, I feel, it's a very unbalanced part of the game. Uh, the amount of schools I've complained, or not complained, but I've been mentioning that throughout this whole series. Oh, this is so good though. This will help on budget and everything. There's nothing bad about doing this that I can see yet. <laughs> I don't speak too soon, though. Okay, schools can go up here. We said as well last episode that we were going to start sorting out loads of police stations, loads of medical centers. Uh, really try and get this city back into its former glory. I deleted a road then. I deleted another one. I deleted a house. I need to fix that because that will annoy me. Fixed. That will really annoy me otherwise. Back on school. Uh, that's not school. School. I have been deleting schools. I haven't been deleting the wrong things, have I? <laughs> Pretty sure I've been doing the right, the right things. Ah, screw it. I hit another road again. I need to fix that. Some of you might be saying, oh, what's the point? But, of course there's a point. Okay. Education. Oh, well, one more there. Okay, so that's all the schools done from this side of the city. And there's just a few on this side. Not too many. Oh, these are just... Oh, I hit a stupid road again. Eh. We've got the high schools to do yet, though, as well. But there's no point doing anything else at the moment apart from remove stuff. Because we have to build our money back up again and our population. So, at the moment, this is the best thing to do. We don't really want to be spending too much more money. We want to be uh, fixing problems, not causing more problems. I can't believe that our education is sorted out, though. It's very late in the game to get that. I know these are end-game buildings. But it would be nice to have the ability to unlock that a little bit earlier. Mind you, I suppose we could have. We just haven't... We never bothered with them at the beginning of the series. We've been trying to do them all a bit too late in the in the game. Yeah, I think it's my fault. Yeah. No, it could have been done better. Oh, so the, the city could have been built better, I will admit. We could have... We could have built some parts better than we have done. But in general, I don't think we've done terribly bad with it. All right, let's get all rid of all the high schools. This is going to save so much money. Uh, think of how much money all of these cost. I mean, how much, how much is the income on this? The upkeep is 840 a week. Just off those schools alone. Each one that we delete is saving us 840 simoleons a week that's crazy so we're saving probably near half a million i expect all of these schools it's got to be somewhere like that okay so that's all the schools around the volcano this is all schools from this giant office district highly educated 52 percent have we done that one as well now then Let's just have a quick check. Yeah, we have. Oh, man. Sweet. Um, How much is that? 130,000. I will put it down. Okay, what does this do then? Have uh, here, visitors can experience fine art. Requirement for building the future power plant. Fine art. It's got to be going in the middle here, right at the beachfront, doesn't it? Can it fit in anywhere? It's huge. It can go right there. It's not a very good place for it. Ah. Oh, it's so close to being able to fit there. Uh, right there. Look at that. Right there. Bang. 
Check this one out. Oh, that's a very artistic building. Does it need water there? It does. I'm never quite sure. Sometimes it lies at the beginning. Look at that, though. It's like a square, pointy building. Oop, frame rate. Yeah, very, very artistic. What does it say? Just tourists and visitors. All right, so we might get some tourists in. We Can we check how many tourists we get in? Pretty sure there is a way. Oh, weekly tourists, 198. That's terrible. That's like hardly any tourists whatsoever. All right, well, let's continue getting rid of these schools and saving us a bunch of money. Look already at our income. Just from deleting what schools we have. That's crazy. We're getting like nearly a quarter of a million a week from this city now. You guys said that I didn't know what I was doing. And yet I've made a city that is unbelievably profitable. And we don't even have our full population yet. Like, uh, we had a population of over a quarter of a million at the beginning of last episode. We probably won't be able to get back up it, to it this episode, but we are getting people in at an alarmingly fast rate. Really, really nice. But the buildings have to upgrade, because all of the buildings that became abandoned have to rebuild up from scratch again, from, like, level one. Shouldn't take it too long to upgrade, but it is still a little bit annoying. But we will speed that up very fast today, especially out in this area. Did I delete a road? Nope. Uh, we will speed it very, very fast up in this area once we start putting the services and the parks down. I think we have a few parks out here. I don't think I neglected this area completely. But service-wise, I, uh, I I forgot. It wasn't deliberate. How can we have dropped down on money? I thought I was getting more money than that. Oh, well, I ain't going to bother. I ain't going to worry about it. Okay, and then there's going to be a few tiny little um, uh, universities around the place as well. What did I delete then? Oh, a tiny little house. I'm bothered by that. These houses should upgrade now as well. What is this? Is that the old university? Yeah, that's the modern one. Oh, sh shoot. Oh, it's just a skyscraper. Yes, I said shoot. Not any other words. Okay, and then there's one right there. And I'm pretty sure that's all of them. All right, amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. That is that's crazy good. Uh, we don't have any of these other buildings. It'd be nice to get the fusion power plant, but we're never going to unlock that. I don't think there's any more of these buildings that I even want to attempt to try and get. That one, nope. Never going to do that again. And that one, we're never going to do. So that's that solved. Okay, anyway. Budget, that's all good. I don't really need to put that up. That's just a waste of money at this point. But, uh, who doesn't have water out here? Oh, bless you. I'll give you some water. There you go. Uh, electric is so through the roof still. I don't know how. So is water and that. Incineration is good. Employment percentage. We knew that was going to drop down. That's no problem. Let's start doing these services. Yeah, so we do have a load of parks out here. But we don't have services. So we're going to put down a nice large medical center right there. And one over here. Anywhere else. I'm going to put one right in the middle of this as well. Somewhere. Right there. We should have... We've got one out there. That should be enough for that area. Uh, what else? We should have one right on the corner here somewhere. Yep. And I think apart from that... Oh, we should have definitely have one out here. Look at this. There's like nothing out here. We'll have a nice big one there. How far does that spread out? Pretty far. I'm going to put another one down. Oh, it'd be nice to put it on that road. Oh, why can't I put it there? Ah, oh, so annoying. Must be because it's just like on a little bit of a wonk or something. Okay, put that there then. Okay, fire. There's no fire stations out here. So we'll put one down there. One down there. One down there. And that should cover everybody. Oh yeah, look at it all turn blue. Ah, oh, we're fixing the city at last. Why is this still red? You know, you can have your own one. There you go, that's how nice I am. Uh, I'm going to put one out here. I'm going to put one there. That's okay. I don't mind that being a little bit red. Oh, down here should be one. Any industrial area should definitely have its own fire station. Are they going blue? They'll turn blue. Are they going to get lighter blue? Is that as good as they're going to get? I'll put another one over here then. And that should make them all go really light blue. That's what we want. Is it? Are they going lighter blue? It's a proper... It's a proper... Please, a uh, fire station. It's a good one. Okay, need some over here. 
Oh yeah, we'd never checked this in the end either, did we? Does this policies work again? It does! Wonderful! Okay, uh, I wanted to select this one. And I wanted a specialization on it, didn't I? How do we do the specialization again? Oh, I've forgotten how to do it. No specialization. Um, wait a minute, we need to go here. Or, oh, that's how you do it. That one. Or, oh, there. Wonderful. Okay, so the buildings should now change to mine ore, which should help out with money as well. Employment is dropping back down. That's okay, that's because we're getting back up into the uh, thing again. But hopefully when officers upgrade, they'll be able to take more people as well. Let's continue on with this. Uh, that's good now. I'm happy with that. Out here, this is the most important part that we were trying to solve. Like that. And then police. Get some cry. Oh, we want big ones. Like this. Uh, one out here. A couple out there. And one down there as well. Alright, so that should solve all of the problems with services. If we zoom in, what is the problem with most people? We've got, we've got this little thing here. Low land value, hey? Why is everyone complaining about land value? Let's check that out. Land value. Nope, not that one. This one? Land value. What do you mean, low land value? Look at it! It's bright green! Our whole city is worth so much money. How is it worth that much? Even these are worth high. How are you complaining about low land value? Maybe you're just, like, not fixed yet. But man! That should be... That shouldn't be the problem. What are these? Too few services? Pretty sure you've got enough services out here. Maybe not. I'll put one there. And I'll put one of these there. Because I'm a nice person. Okay, we should put more down, down more cemeteries now as well. Because there's a lot of dead people about, I noticed. So we'll dot these about. Oh, that's a nice one. That fits in there well. Uh, we need some more up here for sure. <gasps> Did I put one down over here? Do they need water as well? I'm not sure if they do. We'll put one in there. And then they don't need to travel as far. Uh, we should have one out here, really. There's no reason why we shouldn't. Oh, uh, uh, there. Got it. And the same out here. Finishing off the city, guys. Finishing off the city today. Might even be the last episode if we decide to. I would really, really, really like to get our um, employment up. But if the likes and stuff don't stay at a reasonable rate, uh, there's just not, not much point. If, if you guys aren't enjoying it, why should we continue? Um, there. And I'm going to put one more down. There. Okay. So that should be that sorted out. Garbage dumps. Pretty sure garbage is okay. Our landfill is fine. Have they been complaining? I don't think anybody's complaining about garbage individually. Well, he is. But that is only one. There's only a couple. Yeah, no, it's all it's all blue. That's okay. Incineration status is on the brink, but nothing to worry about. And I think that's about it. Uh, close that down. Get rid of the extra Z. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, but the employment percentage, that is still pretty catastrophic. But we can't seem to get jobs close enough to people. Here is a good spot for jobs. Uh, oh, check out these... Or buildings as well. What do these look like? Oh, zoom in. Oh, 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 careful now. It's because they're all being built. Fish stick factory. Ready to wear. Or corporation. There we go. Goods limited box factory. Ice cube factory. Why are there ice cube factories in the ore section? I don't understand. I don't get it. <laughs> these are meant to... Yeah, mining. Okay, maybe they are actually what they're meant to be, but it just doesn't look like it. A lot of them are still changing as well, so we'll leave it there for a while. Maybe they just haven't uh, completely changed yet. Our water doesn't seem to have actually done anything. It seems to just be going up and down. It sort of floods to this area and then goes back out again. It just seems to be a very strange tide that we, we seem to have um, given ourselves. Look at these buildings. Are they tennis courts on the top of the buildings? It's a tennis court and a basketball stadium. Wow! Look at those 25 houses in there. It's because of the land value. So high. They're still complaining about low land value. But 
I cannot see why. Not for the life of me can I understand why. Must be a glitch. Land value is so high. There's nothing you can even argue with there. Okay, let's put down some more jobs out here then. Uh, we'll come off this bit. Let's uh, go to uh, there. There. And I'm not going to join it back up to the road again. Not that the road is too busy. But it's probably just not the best idea. And then to there. To there. Oh, was that on the right one? No, there we go. And... Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Look at our city, guys. I mean, how huge is this? Look how much it's built up, man. It is massive. I've never seen a city skyline city as big as this. I, I've watched, I have watched some city skylines. Uh, you know, making sure that we're doing things right, making sure that people do things similar to us or different from us, you know, trying to get uh, how other people play the game. No one that I've seen has had a city this big. You guys might know one. I know you've been talking about a couple of people in the comments section and how apparently they're better at me than playing it. Yeah, thanks, guys. No, I'm joking. Um, but <laughs> uh, I, I don't watch... I, I haven't like watched the series from start to finish, so I don't know... Uh, if we have a really, really large city compared to some people. I think we do though. I don't think it's been it's not it's not a small city for sure. The population isn't great at the moment, but it is building back up again. Okay. Uh, we don't need any parks or anything like out here. I think it's a good idea to probably have a police station out here and a fire station. I don't think we really need a medical center though out here because it's all gonna be officers. Because they seem to do quite well for jobs. And seeing as though our people are so highly educated, there's not much point doing um, the normal, what do you call it, industry. Because our people are just too smart for that now. Knucklebrain is like one of the smartest cities ever. Can you believe it? I wouldn't have thought that at the beginning of this series. Oh, water. I forgot. I will never get used to that. I've played this now for nearly 40 episodes and I still always forget about making sure there's water for people. And we'll snake that around there. Wonderful. Okay. Power. You will get power once everybody sorts to uh, starts building out. So I'm not going to be too worried about that. Absolutely crazy. Does that bump that up? At last, our, sit, uh, our power is starting to drop down. I actually like to see that because that means our population is starting to really get up there. But that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Um, we might have another episode. I'm going to leave. We might do uh, might be one or two episodes. Next episode will be episode 39. So maybe we'll go to episode 40. 40 episodes is a nice round number to stop at, isn't it? Yeah. All right. So two more episodes. Next episode, I'm going to leave this running and uh, hopefully get our employment percentage back up. We'll monitor it. And then the last episode, we'll do a sort of a world tour and reminisce about the good old days when our city was only like 100 people strong. <laughs> All right, guys. If you enjoyed the episode, hit that like button. If you haven't already, please subscribe. We shall see you. In the next episode, power situation, we shall give that a boost then. There you go. Okay.